U.S. Customs and Border Protection has issued a warning about the possibility of Mideast terrorists making their way into the U.S. through the southern border. Chelsea Torres is live in Eagle Pass, Texas. Chelsea, thanks for joining, the, joining us. Could this be a potential threat? Well, well, Border Patrol does say that they want to remain vigilant, but this is not a threat. Now, remember, this comes after Border Patrol officials just told us that September they saw the highest number of migrants crossing the southern border. One of those entry ports ports is right here in Eagle Pass. A CBP memo obtained by Fox says it's a situational awareness warning. Quote, foreign fighters motivated by ideology or mercenary soldiers of fortune may attempt to obfuscate travel to or from the U.S. to or from countries in the Middle East through Mexico. The group specifically mentioned are Hamas, Palestinian Islamic Jihad, and Hezbollah. Border officials have been told to keep a close eye on military-age males carrying military gear and ones who could be single travelers. Border Patrol says this year alone, they've had over 2 million single adults enter the U.S. As more people come through the border, more arrests have been made. And CBP sources say there's been a steady rise in recent years of FBI terror watch list arrests. 169 arrests were just made this fiscal year. However, Border Patrol says there is no indication any members of Hamas-directed fighters have made it across the border. A former South Texas Homeland Security official says the number of arrests from the terror watch list has become more worrisome. There's not that many agents holding the line anymore. Uh, there's not operational control of the border. Our borders are open and it's an issue of national security. It's a matter of time that we're going to have a very bad day, something similar to what happened in 9-11. Now, Department of Homeland Security said in their 2024 threat assessment that they do expect more migrants to come through our southern border within the next year. And they do expect terrorists or at least say that terrorists could take full advantage of that situation. In Eagle Pass, Chelsea Torres, Fox 32 News. Chelsea, thank you very much.